Hello, my name is Wayne Harvey, and I'm a Fagor induction product specialist. I'd like to take this opportunity to demonstrate for you a versatile and exciting way to cook, the portable induction cooktop. If you're looking for a more efficient, faster, easier, more versatile way to cook, you simply must try the Fagor portable induction cooktop. Induction uses an innovative cooking technology. The Fagor induction cooktop contains a series of magnetic coils beneath the surface. These coils generate magnetic fields that induct a warming reaction in steel and iron-based pots or pans when the cooktop is turned on. The magnetic reaction between the coils and the cookware placed on the surface is what generates the heat, not the surface itself. That means that the cookware heats the food and not the stovetop, and that means a more precise, more even, and much faster heating. You probably noticed that this is a very stylish unit. High quality, Eurocura glass, stainless steel trim, elegant touch controls, and of course state-of-the-art induction technology. And it's so easy to use. To use it, all you do, punch the on button, and that places it in standby. To actually cook, you want to place a pot on the cooktop, and then hit the start button. Now the default is setting power four. That's where it's going to start out. Of course, you can plus or minus from there. But one thing that I really need to tell you is that you do need to use induction compatible cookware. And that sounds pretty complicated, but it's really not. In fact, it's so easy, all you have to do is go over to the refrigerator and grab one of those pretty magnets. See if it sticks to the bottom of your cookware. If it does, it works, no problem. Cookware that is induction compatible includes stainless steel with magnetic bottom, enameled iron and steel, and cast iron. All Fagor cookware is induction compatible. As I said before, the default power level is four. Now if you punch the start button without putting an induction capable pot on the cooktop, it can't generate heat. So it's actually going to beep continually for you to let you know that you haven't done that. After 60 seconds, if you still haven't put a pot on there, it will actually turn itself off. That's one of the safety features. To cook though, put your pot on there and you can actually increase or decrease your power just by punching these buttons right here. The power levels range from one to six. Induction cooks so much faster than gas or electric. It's 50% faster. So you can go from a simmer to a rolling boil in a matter of seconds. And the heating is so precise, and the heat distribution is so even. There's no hot and cold spots. So you can actually even melt chocolate without a double boiler. One of the things that you'll enjoy most, though, is the amount of energy you save. It's so eco-friendly. It uses 90% of the energy. If you've got gas, it's heating up the entire kitchen. With electric, you've got it so hot, you have to have another burner to swap to when it gets there so you don't burn things. With induction, the response is instant and it only heats the pan. The cooktop isn't getting hot. Let me show you something. I can actually put my hand right there and it doesn't burn me. And that's because the heat is going into the pot and the pot is heating the food. That's why it's so eco-friendly and why it saves you so much money on your electric bills. The pot itself is heating the food. The cooktop isn't getting hot. Watch this. Imagine taking something like that and putting it right there. And watch, the water's still gonna boil. There's no flames, there's no smoke, there's no gas emissions because induction cooking is clean. I guess I ought to show you what happened here just so you can see. Oh, you hear that beeping? That's what happens when I take the pan off the cooktop. It's letting me know that there's nothing there. So if I want to stop that, I better put the pan back on there. Something else I want you to know is this. It does have an automatic shutoff. If you were to forget and leave the pan on there, anywhere from two to four hours, depending on what level it was on, it will actually shut itself off, and that's just one of the many safety features. Our cooktop has a timer feature, and this is something you'll probably utilize a lot. It's very, very easy to use. Now, presumably, you've already turned on your cooktop, you've already selected a power level. So what we're gonna do is we're going to tap the timer once. Now you wanna go to the plus or minus. Now, if you go to the plus side and tap it once, that's gonna move it a minute. If you tap it and hold it, that's going to move it 10 minutes at a time. And of course, the opposite is true on the minus side. If for some reason you decide that you want to change the timer in the middle of a recipe, no problem. All you have to do is tap the timer once. 
and then use your plus or minus. It's just that simple. When you're ready to stop the timer altogether, tap the timer twice, and it turns itself off. When you're ready to quit cooking, all you do is punch the off button. I've talked about several safety features already, but this is one that every mother in the country is going to love. It's a child safety lock. Let me show you something. It's right over here, and it's so easy. All you have to do, tap it once. And what that does is that deactivates all your controls. Now, when you're ready to activate it again, all you do is hold your finger on there for a couple of seconds, and that will activate it again so you're good to go again. Before we close, I want to point out just a couple of more things to you. You know, this is a very, very versatile unit. It's lightweight. It's efficient. If you have a, a boat with a galley, an RV, maybe you got one of the kids off in a dorm room, this is the perfect solution to an awful lot of problems. Easy to clean. Food doesn't bake on because the cooktop doesn't get hot. It's fast. It's versatile. It saves energy. I know you're going to really enjoy your Fagor portable induction unit.